Hey, 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 there's my beautiful booze. How are you guys today? I am perfect. I'm getting ready to do some nail art for you guys. Sorry, I'm silly today. <laughs> Sorry. Anyways, I'm going to be swatching the model ones today. I'm doing the model ones acrylic that I just got in the mail. This is the um, Cinderella kit. That I got. You get five 28 gram uh, jars of acrylic. You also get this uh, Model Ones monomer as well, which, um, I mean, this monomer is okay for you to, for, you know, if you're a beginner, if you're, if you're just for practicing purposes, or even if you're just doing 3D nail art, um, I usually use my, uh, my, uh, Glam and Glitz monomer or my Enel Couture. Uh, this monomer is, I mean, it smells just like monomer and everything else. It does have, like, a, a nice smell to it, kind of, but it, uh, the texture is different. Like, it looks a little bit different than what I, it is with my, uh, Glamourless stuff, but it, I mean, it does good for, I mean, for practicing purposes anyways. But I also got, oop, oop, throw them down, these nail forms as well, which I do like these nail forms, you know. Sometimes it's just easier to grab them and go, but anyways. I am excited to swatch these for you guys. Oh, you guys are going to have to let me know how these colors look. Now, I am, like, adjusting my, uh, my, my, I got a new ring light. Let me show you guys. Okay, I'm back. So, I did get to, I just hit the, uh, stop button so anyways this is my new ring light it's humongous it is 19 inches 19 inches it holds your camera holds uh actually holds a big camera too or a big phone <laughs> a big phone <laughs> then it holds my camera of course too so anywho Let's go ahead and get into this video before I get way off track. But before we get started, I do have one more thing that I want to tell you guys. You ready? It's giveaway time. So this is my birthday month, November. I was born. I can't tell you how many years ago because that's just not me to do. Yeah, you know, I just don't want to tell my age, but it's okay. <laughs> it's okay. So, um, my birthday month and the month is for giving and giving back. And that's what I want to do for you guys. So, I'm giving away the Model Ones Dip Powder Kit. Oh, so pretty. So pretty. So, if you're interested in winning this giveaway... There is going to be a couple of rules. Um, the first rule is going to be that you have to be subscribed to my channel. Hmm. Subscribe. And, of course, you guys know I love and appreciate that. Second of all, hit that big old like button. And beside of it, hit that notification bell. <clears throat> so you can get all my latest uploads. And excuse me for that. Sorry. But you can hit that notification bell. That way you get all my latest uploads. And, um, the third thing would be to share this video. Share this video on any social media that you have. It doesn't have to be, it doesn't have to be Instagram. It doesn't have to be a certain social media. Any social media that you want, you can tag me if you like. That way I see it. Um, you can do TikTok. You can do Instagram, Twitter, wherever your social media is at. I would appreciate that from you guys that would just help me out so much um honestly like really that if you do share this video just let just know that i am very thankful and fortunate for such a great community because i have to say you guys have been a really big blessing to me it's like and such positivity from you guys make me want to do more for you guys and better so thank you for that Anyways, let's get into this video. Don't forget to put USA or international by the way. Say, please enter me, USA and international. So, that is these steps. Like, share, comment, because I like to talk to you. And other than that, share this video. Bye. Let's get started.
Yeah, so the next one we have here is number 12. And it's purple. I'm so excited. I've already shaken it. I do like that they cover their acrylic so you don't spill it. Um, that helps out tremendously, I feel like. Because I have the tendency to not spill it that way. And I just put it back in the top of my lid and I just leave it on so it keeps it sealed. Nice and sealed. Anyways, let's go ahead. I am going to take my brush and just kind of do this. Because sometimes even after shaking, um, it, it still needs to be stirred even more. So I'm just going to take it and mix it really, really well. Alright. Here we go. And I have to say, I'm loving these flexi fingers, guys. Seriously. <clears throat> like, I know the hands are nice, but I honestly think I like the fingers better because I have more control over it, and it's like, I don't know. Anyways, you can tilt this up, which I'm going to do. I'm going to tilt my finger up a little higher for you guys. Um, but the thing about that is when you tilt it up like that, I wish I had, like, a knob that you can also, like, once you tilt it up, you can bend the finger, you know, back down. Okay, I'm going to leave it about right there. I think that'll be good. Because I had it too low a while ago, and I, I noticed it when I went to um, turn the finger down. It was too close to my um, desk. Alright, so, here we go. There's three. Let it soak up. Now, like I said, this is the Model 1's monomer. And so far, I have to say, it's doing really, really nice. Um, now, when I go off screen like that, I am actually um, just cleaning my brush and probably like dipping back into the um, monomer. Ooh, it's such a pretty color. It's like a translucent purple and it's gorgeous. Which I, guys, I, I mean, I don't know why, but I am like in love with um, jellies. Jellies are one of my fave right now. Jellies and cat eye, and I love chrome powders. Like, oh. Uh, I could go into a whole story about chrome powders. Oh, God. I love chrome powders, and there's so many things you can do with it. I, I need to do a video of some, like, different ideas with chrome powders or something. Uh, like I said, if you guys want to see something like that, may, uh, let me know. And I will definitely, definitely do a video for that because like I said, I mean chrome powders are amazing. I just want to make sure that's flush. I don't want it to be like you don't want to drag off the color though. Don't drag it off guys. Like be really, really um soft handed if you can. Um, I know sometimes it gets really hard, like right now it's kind of hard for me because I feel like where the finger is resisting me that I'm having a hard time, um, uh, like having a hard time with it, like not being too, like where I'm pulling it downwards this way, where I'm used to going this way, it's pulling off the color for me. So, I got to move it down a little more because that, that's, you just have to keep adjusting it until you get it where you want it. And I really do think that maybe that's okay. That's what I should have done the, to begin with. It's just kept, you know, moving it up and down until I locked it. Um, and that's something you'll have to do when you get your, uh, if you order these flexi uh, fingers. I totally recommend it for those of you who like to paint. 
and you know do a lot of nail art because I like I had to say that I'm excited because uh, for me this is amazing because this way I can practice painting and get better and better you know what I mean like I'm putting some right here because I feel like I missed this side again this is the side that I always miss so like I don't know why this side and uh, when I'm doing clients it's just like I always miss this side I don't know why but I do if you feel like you got something on your client just wipe it out That was so creamy it worked so well that monomer did with that um acrylic i'm like really super shocked right now how well it did i am gonna pull a little bit of it up like i said i'm gonna keep my um tip thin and i'm just gonna cut this out it's giving me a little time to work with it which i like um so i feel like it's kind of a slow setting I'm just going to push that up and then go around and make sure the sidewalls are clean. The nail tip is trying to come out on me. Okay, there we go. And I'm just going to make sure that that is clean. Can still move it just a little bit so I am gonna move that just a little bit but that is like so pretty I'm just gonna wet my brush and I'm gonna start pulling it down because it's still letting me move it that's the reason I said I think this is a slow setting primer Mm, 
that looks so nice. I'm just making sure the back acrylic is even. Using the belly to push that down. And then I'm going to take a little bit of monitor back over again, smooth it out. You want to try to get this as perfect as you can. That's the key. <clears throat> is to get it perfect. Oh, that's so pretty. I hope you guys like that. Oh, nice. I am going to put a little bit up here at the top. I feel like I missed a little bit. I always do. This is my little area that I always forget. Or I don't seem to get two anyways. But I think a lot of it has to do with my brush. Where I uh, wipe on that side. The way I wipe. I'm just going to clean my brush really good. Keep that acrylic out of it. And alright. So let's let that one dry and I'll be back. Okay, so the last one was really opaque. This one looks like a glitter one. So like I said, I'm shaking it really well. And this one is number 24. Ooh, it is silver and oh, white. Is that white? Mm, that looks so pretty. I'm excited. I'm going to clean my brush off before I go into a new uh, jar, of course. And then we're going to pick this up. Now, glitter usually doesn't take very much to pick it up. So, you don't need a whole lot of glitter. Because, like I said, you're, you're just creating a background with it. Unless you want, like, really, really pigmented um, acrylic. Or pigmented. Listen to me. Unless you want, um, like, a lot of glitter. Um, totally up to you. Um, if you want it scattered, if you want it, you know, yeah, no, it's up to you, boo-boo, if you want a completely glittery background, or if you want just, like, little bits of it, or however you like. But now this is beautiful. I have to say this is beautiful. Man, that looks so pretty. Don't you just love glitter? Like, oh, that is nice. So I'm just going to pick up a really small bead, not a big one. And we're just going to apply it right here. I'm going to turn my brush around, pull this back. And it's going to give it that smooth line. You're not going to have any harsh line there where you added glitter or anything like that and then I just pat it out like this that way it's all nice and smooth and then I pat a little bit more and then I make sure I touch the edge this side clean and this side clean and like I said you want to make sure that that cuticle is nice and perfect now I'm just going to make sure that this glitter is perfect. Now, look, ain't that gorgeous? And didn't take very much at all. So this, I mean, these acrylics are going to last you for a long time, you know? Like I said, you're you're gonna you're gonna use these for a while. They're very nice. I'm loving these. All right, so let's go ahead and let that dry, and I'll be back. Okay, the last one is number twenty-three, and it 
is shimmery it has a beautiful fine glitter in it I can see it throughout the outside at first I thought it was just a clear and then I started seeing the sparkle through it and I thought oh no it's gonna be beautiful gonna be beautiful boo let's see oh oh my mama look at that I don't know if you guys can say that or not though, but it's got these little sparkles in it, green, blue, you can see uh, like iridescent. Oh. Model ones, you've oh, created some really beautiful acrylics. I'm loving it. All right, so let's get this first bead and see what this looks like. I'm so excited. Oh yes, I'm so excited. Look, oh. Goodness, goodness, goodness. And here are the final results guys these are the five colors I got in this Cinderella acrylic kit from model ones I hope you guys enjoyed it let me know what you guys think I think it's fabulous I really love the new uh, formula that they have for their acrylic powders they are working really great and I have to say I am really shocked with their monomer that I used this time 
it was so different. So I feel like they are working on their marmor as well. So I was really surprised and happy with the results of it. So definitely if you are beginners or anything like that, or even if you are a professional, you know, like I said, they are rechanging their formulas and things like that. They are improving it. I enjoyed it very much so, but like I said, if you're just starting out and you're looking for a, an affordable acrylic kit, Model 1s is amazing. So go and check them out. I will have a link down below for you guys so that way you can go and purchase this kit if you like. Um, I do have several other ones down below as well, discount codes that you can go and try. But I just want to say thank you guys so much for all the love and support. And don't forget to enter this giveaway. Like I said, I'm giving away a Model 1s dip putter kit. Um, I will do that when I hit probably like, maybe like a hundred subscribers, um, maybe two. Um, but anyways, um, or maybe on my birthday, I will announce the, uh, winner to the Model Ones Dip Powder Kit. My birthday's on November the 28th. Anyways, if you would love, to, I would love for you to try to maybe subscribe to one of my other channels, uh, or social medias, if I could talk tonight. You know, like TikTok, Instagram, Twitter, whichever one you like, I'll give you an extra entry for that. But you have to make sure you put Enter Me, USA or International. Make sure that you hit that subscribe button. You have to be subscribed to my channel, channel, and make sure you hit the like button as well. And just share this video, guys, on any social media that you have. And but like I said, if you uh, go and join one of my social medias, I will give you an extra point. Make sure you tag me in it so I know that you have joined. Um, there will be a post on Instagram that you can go check out if you have Instagram for the giveaway. So anyways, guys, I love you all. Uh, stay tuned. Don't forget to hit the notification bell as well so you get all my uploads. And I'll see you in the next one, guys. Bye.